I've poured one tablespoon of warm water into this measuring cup. So this is the cornstarch. So I'm gonna be cutting it just a little bit on the corner. Just like that. And we're gonna pour three to four tablespoons of, of cornstarch. So I am now going to be mixing the water with the cornstarch. I'm gonna oops, incorporate it together. Now, as you can see, it is pretty dry by now, but that's okay because it says we will add a few squirts of glue in, which is good, and I'm also gonna add in some paint. So now I've added some glue, I'm gonna show you right now what it looks like. It looks like white powder with some kind of other juice. So now I'm gonna mix that. It is getting more liquidy, but it still isn't. So I have this orange paint with this cornstarch. This is what it looks like. And now I'm gonna incorporate it so that it is all orangey kind of slimy texture. It doesn't really feel slimy, but it's okay because we might add a little bit of more paint and a little bit of more water. I have put in some water because it was really thick and clumpy. So I think it's time to meet it up with my hands on our mat. So I'm just going to carefully try and get this thick. I think it's black. So I'm really happy with how this turned out. It's a little bit look how it looks like inside. And I have a cool effect. I'm going to show you what it does. So I put it in a circle and it starts melting very slowly. So now my next step, I just chose this, this is optional. I am going to be putting some gems into my slime. So I'm gonna fold them so that they're not sticky anymore. And then I'm gonna rip them off and put them inside my slime. how it turned out. It looks very cool. It feels very fluffy. I very enjoyed it. And um, um, maybe, hmm, <gasps> but what if you don't have this and you don't have cornstarch? Oh yeah. So I am going to be teaching you how to make your own slime. So bye. See you guys next time. See you in the next series. This is Kiddo Box and Box. Bye!